morning you guys for the past like three four days i have not been going to the gym i haven't been on my grind coming off of the weekend because as you guys know from my last video angel got two kittens we do have the second one now she definitely will make an appearance in a bit but she's just hiding because she has been so scared so the one that we just got is named Tupi, and then the one that we already had that we got a few days ago is named Binu. And Tupi is very, very scared compared to Binu. Like Binu warmed up to us right away and she's not very much of like a scared girl. But Tupi is very much scared. So we just got her like two days ago, not even. We haven't even had her for 48 hours yet. So we are waiting until she kind of just warms up to the house and we're letting her be. Yeah, I have been a kitty mother, okay? And they have not been a lot of work at all, to be honest, but I just can't help but cuddle them and pet them and just stare at them. And so it has inhibited me from going to the gym and from being productive. Like I, you, you guys usually know I'm go, go, go and I'm always doing something. And I honestly don't feel good being out of my routine. Like I'm really excited to get back to the gym tomorrow but it has been nice to kind of just have a few rest days and you know take life slow like i really wanted to prioritize over these past few days having a slow morning because i feel like i never have slow mornings like the second i get out of bed i'm getting ready for my workout i go work out right away and then i come back i'm already making breakfast i'm getting to work and so i don't really have slow mornings except for on the weekends and so i have really been enjoying like taking my mornings more slow and just easing myself into the day sleeping in until like eight o'clock instead of waking up at five and it's been really really nice so that has been my past few days and i haven't really been picking up the camera or anything i have been having to do some editing and stuff but I haven't been filming at all just to take a little bit of a break and really just spend time and be present with the new little kitties because I feel like that's super important like giving them all my attention so I wanted to start the vlog today because I have a lot of stuff in the house that just needs to be clean I have a whole list of stuff that I need to do and so I thought you guys love the cleaning vlog so why don't I do another one for you guys I need to clean the bathroom there's just like a bunch of stuff like tidy needs to be done and it's gonna feel good once it is done so i'm excited to do that today but like i said i am easing into the day i just made myself a coffee i did already kind of do my makeup for the day and now i'm just gonna enjoy my coffee maybe do some emails whenever i don't work out i feel it in my body like my body starts to ache and even though i've been walking it's just not the same for me i love myself some good exercise it makes me feel so good so it's days like this where you realize like okay this is why i am so strict on myself and why i do my routine every day is because it actually really does make me feel better sometimes you have to take time off your routine to really realize how good it makes you feel and why you do it so that has been me these past few days and it's okay in life you know to take some breaks once in a while i was like catching myself for a minute being like oh you're so lazy what are you doing today but i'm like no like whoa like calm down like this is life okay and i'm allowed to take some time off with my new babies anyways that is the gist for today we're gonna do some cleaning ease into the day yeah these past couple days have just been so cute like oh my gosh so happy we got the kittens binu making an appearance say hi two bees hiding like i said but binu is so cuddly well not right now she wants out but say hi <laughs> Guys, I can't. Like, this is where I've been the past few days. I can't. Like, I'm obsessed. It is just overtaking my life. She came out of her little hiding spot. Where are you going, silly girl? Oh. <laughs> They're so funny. guys so i am just eating this little quino salad that joel's mom actually gave us so good and so like light and refreshing like a summer little lunch i was just editing for like three hours because i had to finish up my vlog that is going up in like an hour so i just finished that up it's scheduled to go up so kind of done my computer work for the day now i just want to give my house a good clean but i didn't really eat much this morning because i wasn't feeling hungry i have been having kind of coffee on an empty stomach recently because i've just been obsessed with our smeg espresso machine i just am craving it every morning now so i haven't been eating before and then i think that the coffee suppresses my appetite because i usually always eat and then have the coffee since i've been having a slow mornings like i was telling you guys i have been 
slurping my coffee before I get have anything to eat. I make sure to have some water before though because I want to keep hydrated and like flush my body, but I just can't resist. I am super, super hungry now, so I am having this for lunch. But yeah, I just uploaded my getting a kitten vlog and if you guys haven't seen it yet, make sure to go watch it because I'm obsessed. I'm so happy because the sun has actually been coming out a lot recently. It was supposed to be raining all week, but the forecast kind of changed and it's so nice seeing the sun out and it just makes the house so much brighter. It makes such a big difference. The fact that the days are getting so long. Comment down below what time the sun sets where you guys live because the latest in the summer that it sets here is like literally 9 30. It sets so late, which is amazing. Right now it's setting at about 8 8 30. We get such long days here at this time of year, which is amazing. I love it. The sun rises like at five and it's so good. But yeah, I have heard that not not everywhere is like the same when it comes to that type of stuff so i'd be super interested to know if you guys can comment down what time it sets right now and also where you live yeah it's interesting just like different areas of the world but anyways i'm gonna eat this it's so good and then we will start cleaning because then i'll feel a little bit rejuvenized and i also got a package the new bedding came in that i showed you guys a couple vlogs ago so we're gonna put that on today i'm so excited we've had the couch like this for the past um since we got the kittens we have just made this a huge area where we played with them and stuff but now i think that it's time we could dismantle the couch and make the living room more normal again we could still have the couch semi covered we just wanted to cover it in case they made an accident or something but i think i'm just gonna put the couch in the regular position and just clean up this area because it does look like a mess it looks super super comfy this is called bed mode and i love it but i don't like it like this all the time because it just feels like it's messy you know so i'm gonna dismantle the couch and just clean around because I think that it is time to put the couch back to regular now. gosh couch area looks so much better i just feel like the house is gonna get back to normal now we have all the kid stuff sorted out so this is just making me so happier because it looks so much cleaner directly correlates to my mental state like seriously oh my gosh so much better these are all the sheets that were on the couch so obviously they're gonna need a nice wash since we've been playing with the kittens on them all weekend long so i'm gonna do a load of laundry of these sheets and then we'll dry and put them away when they're done a bit later these are kind of the extra sheets that we have usually we can <gasps> hi doopy um we used to cover the couch and stuff so yeah i'm gonna wash them fresh sheets is just the best <laughs>
package from Urban Outfitters came in as I was telling you guys earlier, the duvet cover. For the spring, if I can find it, if it's still in stock, I will link it down below. And if I forget, just remind me in the comments. But I am so excited for her. So let's open the package and we're gonna refresh the bed a little bit. I just washed the sheets like the under layer sheets of the bed so I don't need to wash them again those are my favorite Brooklyn in sheets so I'm just going to leave them and not wash them because like I said I just washed them like a couple days ago so we're just going to put it, this new duvet cover on let's open it together Urban Outfitters actually has some good like home stuff surprisingly oh my god look at how cute this design is for spring it comes with two pillow covers and then a full duvet cover so i'm gonna unbox this take it out and then we're gonna put this on the bed i'm so excited oh my gosh i just love changing my bed sheets because i feel like it's a really good way to kind of refresh your room and stuff for every season and it really does change things like it can completely transform your room which is cool so <laughs> just finished doing cleaning the bedroom this bed sheet set is so freaking cute and it's just the perfect bed sheets for summer um yeah i love the color as well like the blue white cream colorway is so pretty and just reminds me of summer and yeah i'm actually obsessed with the design on it and it's just all i ever wanted it just feels so nice having a freshly cleaned bedroom especially because we had the kitties like we put the litter box in here and everything before so it's so nice that it's nice fresh and clean now i'm obsessed <laughs> Her shell. She is coming out of her shell. Are you looking at me because you want some more food? Let me feed them again. Girls are eating dinner. When Tupi eats, I'm pretty sure this bowl might be a little bit big for her because she stands on it. So maybe I should give her a little bowl for when she's still small. But this girl has no problem. So they're kind of the same size. <laughs> so maybe it's just her liking to stand on her food bowl. I'm not sure. How cute are they? Look at these little beans eating. <laughs> Guys, I can't. They literally have all my attention. Like, I can't do anything else when they're around because they're so cute. Good job eating your dinner. Get those nutrients in, girls. Get those vitamins in, Mrs. Queens. Thank you so much to Squarespace for sponsoring another one of my videos. I love them so much. If you guys don't already know what Squarespace is, they are the all-in-one website platform to help entrepreneurs succeed within their business. So whether you're just starting a business or whether you already own like a successful running business, Squarespace has everything and all the tools that you need. They make it just super easy to create a beautiful aesthetic website, engage with your audience, sell anything from content to products to time, all in one place and also all on your terms. So you could start a completely personalized website with their new guided design system, Squarespace Blueprints. You could choose from professionally curated layout and styling options to build a unique online presence from the ground up, tailored to your brand or your business and optimized for every device. 
You can easily launch your website and get discovered fast with integrated optimized SEO tools so you can show up more often to more people and grow the way you want. Squarespace also has very flexible payment methods so you can use Apple Pay, PayPal, credit cards, and you can also offer your customers to buy now and pay later. This just all makes the checkout experience super seamless for your customers. So if you guys are interested, click the link in my description and go to squarespace.com for a free trial and then when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash Bento and you could save 10 percent off your first purchase of a website or domain. Hey guys, so Madison and I are currently at Ikea. I really want to do our spare bathroom because since we moved in, we haven't really done the spare bathroom. Like the bathtub needs a curtain or the shower needs a curtain. Also, everything is kind of a mess. Like we just dump random things in the tub there and we don't have like proper storage. So I really want to just like do the bathroom, especially now that we have the kids because I don't really want them going in the bathroom with like all the stuff everywhere because they can find like little nooks and crannies to hide in so i'm planning on getting like a shower rod here at ikea and curtains hopefully we can find everything and then just a couple random things and then i want to go to home sense after to get some bins for storage and also like a laundry bin because we don't have one for just like our towels and stuff that's the plan i'm gonna see what i find and then just kind of go from there yeah we're gonna do a little bathroom makeover bring you guys along and this has been long awaited i've been wanting to do this for months now so finally just getting it done so anyways let's go into ikea So I just got back from HomeSense and Ikea. I pretty much found everything that I needed, which is great. So I'm going to give you guys a bit of a haul. Then we're going to go upstairs, clean the bathroom, and install everything. I bought a curtain rod. I bought curtains, like for the shower, just because it's going to clean it up nice. Now we can actually use that shower or when people stay over, they can actually use that shower because with no curtain, the water's going to be splashing everywhere. So, and I also do my makeup in that bathroom. I started to do my makeup there just because I don't have a vanity anymore. And so I just want it to be nice and clean and tidy and organized because for my sake of mind. So we stopped at HomeSense slash Winners. And you guys know if you have a HomeSense slash Winners near you, you go in there and you spend two hundred dollars three hundred dollars like that because there's just so much good stuff so this is unrelated to the bathroom haul but you guys look at these guest little platforms are you kidding me for the summer these are such a sleigh find i am so obsessed right on my size seven and a half these are going to be worn like every single day in the summer when i go out so these are sleigh and they were only sixty dollars so super happy about these I got some Tommy Hilfiger um, underwear. You can never use enough underwear. And then I got this bin because I need a bin for storage above our coat closet there just to put anything that we need. I'm thinking about putting our bed sheets in here because we have nowhere to store bed sheets right now. So it's kind of annoying. I feel like it's going to be perfect. And then from HomeSense, I also got unrelated bathroom still but i got these baking sheets because our baking sheets are completely deteriorated i bought super cheap ones when we first moved into our apartment like two years ago and they are just they need to be thrown out this was well needed it was only 25 dollars for this set and i feel like that's pretty good um considering these get really expensive so yeah this is originally 50 bucks and it was 25 at HomeSense. So this is the sleigh and just like something we really needed. Next thing I got from HomeSense is this little storage basket that I'm planning on putting in the bathroom. I'm either gonna use this for towels or for like laundry, but I'm pretty sure I'll end up using it for towels, just like storage. Cause we don't really have good like laundry storage. Our laundry situation is kind of like an apartment where it's just like the two laundry machines and there's no like place to store anything. So that's why it's like, we don't really have a linen closet. I don't know, we're gonna see after I like organize everything in the bathroom, but this is definitely needed for something. The last thing I got from HomeSense is this painting. I just couldn't pass it up. I think it's so pretty and I love the frame. I love the painting and I don't know where I'm gonna put it yet. I might like replace the one in my room for this so we'll see it honestly it looks like that emoji like the picture frame emoji it looks exactly like this but anyways so gonna put this up somewhere not sure where yet but i just i fell in love with it i cannot pass her up this is like my painting style i love it so much i'm actually gonna put a painting here eventually and my mom is gonna paint it for me this is probably a little bit too small for here i want something bigger so now for ikea i got this curtain rod because we're gonna need to install that or 
It's like suction cup, I think. And then I got this for the inside of the shower because there's no like shampoo places to put shampoo or anything. So this is gonna go in there. And then I also got the curtain hooks so it can like go across. I randomly needed a measuring cup, so I got that. It's like a liquid one. And then I also just got these two little cute um, espresso cups. Like, are you kidding me? I couldn't pass these up. These are the curtains that I got. I got two because I didn't know if one was going to fit across. So I can always return one if we don't use it. And then I got these little baggies because we are in need of little baggies. Yeah, I didn't know Ikea had them. So they are they have like little cute floral designs on them. So I'm like, you know what? Why not? And then last thing in the hall is just this bath mat. It's just beige. It's soft. It's plain. We just needed one for that bathroom. So I'm going to bring you guys upstairs, show you, you know, what the deal is. And then let's get organizing and cleaning and setting up everything. Here is the bathroom. I'm honestly embarrassed to show you this because it is a mess right now and as you can see on this side there's just random things everywhere and in the tub there's a bunch of like towels that have nowhere to go so this is a well needed clean slash or slash organization and i'm really excited to do it i'm gonna do like a time lapse so you guys can see the process but i'm so excited just to get this looking good and actually putting everything in its place because we've been using this as a dump and i hate doing my makeup in here when it's messy like this so let's get this looking all nice and good after of the bathroom oh my gosh it looks so much better i can't even begin to explain it's just so organized and clean and i think i like the matte color choice and i love the basket here i think i'm gonna put clean towels in there because we have nowhere else to store them like i said so yeah i love this little unit here organization this is like 15 bucks at ikea i already had it so i just brought it out because now i can actually use it this basket was a good addition because now we have extra storage in here and love the shower curtain it was so cheap and it's a sleigh i still have all my makeup out here which is great so i think this was a success and it just feels so much better and looks so much better mm -hmm. 